fixed bodies here, but they belong to cars, not people. So the owner of this repair shop was stunned to find out it was listed as an enrollment site for Obamacare. And he's not the only one. The phones are ringing off the hook at the Apex car and limousine service, but it's not to order rides. They were listed on the New York State Health Exchange website as a place to sign up for health care. The manager told me that's simply not true, and he can't believe they'd make a mistake like that. I would have made sure that it works before I would have go live with that website. You have to make sure that everything right. I mean, it's government. They employ a lot of people. A state health department spokesperson confirms New York was given a $27 million federal grant to hire 50 nonprofit organizations and 96 subcontractors as health care navigators. They were supposed to identify locations where people could meet and go over options. Places like Brooklyn Cupcake, another business that had no idea Obamacare was on the menu. At first, I thought, well, maybe they're doing this promotion with us, and we didn't know about it, you know, sign up, get a cupcake free. The state health department says a sign-up site is anywhere a navigator could meet with an enrollee, even a car repair shop. There doesn't even have to be a table or chairs. Co-owner Marco Abad told me he has no idea how he ended up on that list. It's crazy because we don't know anything about that. It's a big surprise for us. He says like many small business owners, he has his own problems with Obamacare and didn't need another burden. The health department says they're going through the entire list to make sure the phone numbers listed are actual places where people can enroll and hope to have it corrected within a day or two. Something is really bad, I guess, because that kind of mistake is something huge. The business owners were not told when their telephone numbers will be taken off the health exchange website. For now, they're trying to handle the calls as best they can while handling their business. In Sunset Park, I'm Lisa Evers, Fox 5 News.